So I had an idea. And to be honest, uh, yep, yeah, uh, I don't know. Oh. So I've decided that today I'm going to make an upgrade taco cave, which is like Taco Man secret base. Because to be honest, my room sucks. It's a mess. Like, let, let me give you a clip to give you an idea. Okay, so I've already started a little bit, but not much. Um, yeah, that's the door. Um, yeah, you know, there's my dresser. This is, like, the messiest area. I'm gonna be cleaning that up in this video. Um, there are the Legos down there. There's my horrible bed, you know. I'm gonna take some things off the wall, obviously. Um, that, I wanna be the taco computer area. Um, there's a window. Don't know. I don't think I'm gonna cover that up. It seems dumb. You know, bookshelf, that's the taco mobile that I'm working on. It's upgraded, not done yet though. You know, messy closet, I'm not fixing that. That is just impossible to fix. And, you know, hamper, um, you know, like, another bookshelf. This is, like, the best bookshelf because it has the coolest Lego sets, like, to give you an idea. You know, Razor Crest, Slave One, don't even know if it's probably just a space station. Let's call it the ISS. The Boulder Blaster. And, you know, the Tony Stark's, like, you know, private jet thing. Um, the, these two are probably the biggest on here. This one's definitely the biggest. Definitely. It's like $130. I don't know. I didn't buy it. I turn on the lights. Um, you know, also, I want to keep this definitely. You know how, like, okay, you know how Batman has, like, a giant, like, dime or, like, a giant coin in the back cave? Well, that's gonna be my coin. That's like, and it, it works. It works. There's a bunch of old gumballs in there that I probably shouldn't eat. Um, but yeah, so, um, I think I'm gonna try to do a time lapse if I can, and if I can't, I'll just, you know, like, you know, tell you what, show you what happened. So, this is the update. Most, pretty much all of this stuff was already here except for the switch. But, um, you know, I had kind of cleaned it up. That's not yet. That's the next episode. <laughs> Um, that's not also supposed to be, that's supposed to be on my backpack, and that is a puzzle. But, basically, it's got the taco facts, don't know how, uh, it's kind of hard how well you can read it from a dis for difference, but it clearly says taco facts, and it is functionable. And then there's a Lego mug, mug which I should move. Um, stupid deodorant. If you stick a piece of paper, okay, let's just, just don't, don't ask questions about what that was. You stick paper to the back of here, there's a little, like, ramp thing, and it goes down to here. Um, so yeah, I can use that in episodes. There's the taco phone, where, you know, I can just go, like, hello. And then there's, like, some sort of crystal thing that lights up. And, um, actually, let's see if it works. Uh, hang on, let me pause the video. Yeah, that's too confusing for me to figure out right now, so I'm not gonna try to do it. But, um, yeah, there's a bunch of wires and stuff on the inside. My wallet, don't really need that right now. Um, then there's, like, this little game. What's it even called? It's, like, a mixture of, like, um, like, uh, Plinko Ball and, like, Ping Pong or something like that. You can just go, like, let's see. Okay, that, that sucked. Let me, like, let me do this in my left hand. And then... Problem is, is I'm using the the problem is I'm using a is you bleh, I'm using a camera to be honest. Then I've got like this prototype like burrito man hammer, so I can like if I go to fight him I can go like, because you know Taco Man is pretty much Batman. Batman is always planning how to like kill like everyone he knows in case they went evil like that's like his hobby. Um, and my next plan is to take some things off the wall. This. Possibly this, and this. I don't, don't know about the painting. I think I'm going to keep it. And then this. Um, so I'll do that, and, you know, I'll tell you once it's done. Oh, hang on, I forgot to close my door. Ooh, you can't know where the taco cave is. That's top secret information. Um, anyways, though, so that looks better. Didn't take off the star, because I don't really remember how I even mounted it on the wall. But, um, and I took off the paper over there. Still got the shield, puzzle, you know, uh, like, poster, Yankees thing, painting, Iron Man, like, comic book cover, like, I don't know what to call. Oh, gosh, my throat. Yeah, I don't even know how to explain what just happened. I, like, swallowed spit, and it was, I don't know. 
It's like thick. It's not an actual comic book, but it's like a picture of a comic book cover. And this thing I did in like kid. Remember what that's called either. And then like a Bible verse for when I was born, and then um, a poem that my dad wrote for me, and then um, a picture for when I went to an arcade with my friends. Oh yeah, and also, you know, I also got like some awards for like karate, another karate thing, as some weird school thing and weird thing from like a football game. That's not really a word. I was gonna move that. And I, next, I think I want to clean up this shelf, because it's got a bunch of things I don't need. So, yeah, there you go. I considered moving away the taco pinatas, but I don't know, you know where else to put them. I could hang them from the ceiling somewhere. I don't really know where, though. So, yeah, that's pretty more clean, you know. I left, like, all the Diary of a Woody Kid books I have. Almost the entire collection, except for the brand new ones. Let's see, going up to number 15. As of right now. And then I got the Gravity Falls, like, Journal 3 book. The Iron Man model. <clears throat> and then the 1969, I think, yeah. No, it's like 1966 Batmobile. Lego set. And then, um, a speaker. Bluetooth speaker. And then, these are already done, too. Um, this is, like, the trophies. You can, like, close the, you know? You can, like, close the things to make it, you know, hidden. Oh. See, the problem with having a window in here is that then you give away your location. But whatever. Baseball bat, that's not a trophy. Rocket ship that he saved. Um, there's a rock from the moon. Um, not actually. There's his only weakness, a baseball, but, you know, in a case, so that, you know, like, you know, when it doesn't bother him. There's a missile that he also stopped. There's a bomb that he defused. It's also, you know, he re- I, I, <coughs> he repurposed it. I repurposed it. As an alarm clock, and just, you know, mostly it's a repurpose of it as a radio and a clock. Um, a trophy from when I saved the Ark Encounter. It's like a life-sized Ark. Um, a Lego trophy I got from the mayor. And the foot of a turkey. Not fake. That is actually a real foot. I should make a video on that. Then I cleaned this up. And, um, my dad made this. I don't really know what it is, but it's a fist-headed wolf so that should be one of his, my villains um a picture picture frame made out of legos um that's a picture of the food league or most of us you know saving the lego store i don't know if this is only sold at the lego store i assume it is it seems like that this was bought at the lego store i don't know what in both of these giant lego bricks you can store things in them don't really know what you want to you know put in there um another machine don't even know what it does. I'm pretty sure it, like, colors things, though. Like, you spin that around and it, you know, colors it. Um, glow-in-the-dark M for my name, my actual name. And a bottle from the Mayflower, for the Mayflower con con uh, Compact. From the Mayflower 2. Um, you know, Bible verse on a fish. I think it was my dad's. And then we've got the taco lamp, which, as you will see, is very bright. Like, that... That is, like, that lights up the entire room. Um, you got, like, a taco, like, helmet. And, um, you know, Captain America shields. You know, a bunch of America's, American coins. Lego Nintendo Switch. A few Lego sets. And, um, next up, I need to find a place for that, um... You know, actually, I'm not gonna... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna move the bathrobe. Okay, so my plan is to keep the entire, or at least part, of the taco suit there... So, luckily, I found a place for the bath room. Yeah, no, I didn't find a place. I didn't fix that. I didn't find a place for that. Yeah, I'm going to leave that there for now, and I'm going to, like, you know, mind storm on it. Um, next up is the taco computer area. Um, we're going to get into the gadgets in the next episode. Oh, a little preview. I did make some tacos. Let's see how they fly next episode, and they are good. So, basically, I've done some of it. There's another machine here, which, like, kind of draws, like, it moves around with a robot arm, and it kind of draws on it with, like, black light. It's like a black light thing. There's an Iron Man helmet, and there's a few Legos for my Avengers compound down there, which, it's a mess down there. Um, but, you know, that's just kind of part of it, but up here. And I gotta go to the bathroom. Okay, know that it looks like not, that, like, nothing, but... 
I took the weird Hulk plushy thing that I got for free at a yard sale. Like, you can take his pants off. That's the reason I got it. He looks creepy. Fact. You know what? No. Makes it weird. Um, I did clean up, like, this area. And so basically what it is, is the Taco computer is equipped with access to all of the internet. It has a selfie camera. You know, it has access to plenty of apps, you know, editing apps, games. Oh, also, you can play the dinosaur game on it if you turn off your Wi-Fi. I've also got some accessories like um, a mouse, and headphones. I think I'm going to customize them, if possible. Same laptop, well, same laptop that I actually customized, um, okay, about a year back. Still got the Armageddon button. You know, don't, don't press that. So... I'm not just doing this to upgrade and, you know, make more, better stuff, Taco Man equipment. The show and the movies, it's... It has a more serious meaning. I feel like this looks like the, movie, the cover of, like, just something. I don't know. You see, crime in this town has gone up extremely. As you can see, I'm very tired. I've been doing my research. Um, but, it's just, it's too much. It's too much for this town. Okay? It's too much. I'm here, right? Sorry. I just, you know, I'm, there's always, like, car, really fast cars driving by my house. See, speeding! That's what I'm getting at. There's crime in my town. Uh, Fredonia. And also, uh, Brock. It's Fredonia, Brockton. Portland, Palm I didn't protect all those. And sometimes, actually, no. So, I live in the Fredonia area. But I also, you know, I, I, yeah, I live there. I protect it. But, you know, I'm also pretty close to a city named called Buffalo. You may know it you know, better. You know, it's pretty close to New York City. It's like, actually, really close. It also has a pretty close connection. You can go to their bridge that just goes to Canada. So. I've never been to Canada, but I might have to fight crime there, too. This world, it needs actual superheroes. We don't just need actors and books. People dressed up as superheroes. We don't just need movies, shows, books to protect us. No. We need we need a real freaking superhero. So I've taken upon my tiny shoulders like, oh, I'm a girl. Look at that. That's tiny. People would say I'm a girl back at my old school. We're pulling them and just walk up and be like, girl. Yeah, it was really annoying and weird. I don't know. That's really funny in mind. But, um, basically, I'm a superhero. And a lot of you are probably saying, hi, you're a kid. And you can't be a superhero. I think there's one other superhero that I know that's around my age, and it's Miss Marvel, because she's a fictional person. Um, Spider Man, when he became a superhero, he was like two years older than me. Put that in your mind. Just because they're fictional people doesn't mean that they're not real. They're real. <laughs> yeah, so that's, uh, that's my little secret, I guess. Um, uh, and yes, this will be a series. Um, so that's ending it up because it's 8 14. I want to eat some dessert. No, it's gotta wrap it up. Watch like a, a movie or something. I don't know. So, um, yeah, that ends chapter one of this. I don't know what I'm going to call this series. I think I'm just going to label this video chapter one. I don't know. I'm pretty lazy.